Let me start off with an apology because I insulted a couple people on my last YouTube video. I hope you guys know I was kidding when I said Chavo Guerrero was hired because he was ugly by WWE. Chavo comes from one of the greatest wrestling families in the business. And obviously, Chavo got hired because he's a great wrestler. And Tommy Dreamer is a hardcore wrestling legend. He ruled ECW and it was a pleasure and an honor to work with him in TNA and WWE. So when I said Tommy tongue kisses sailors on a pier for rent money, it's not true. Tommy tongue kisses sailors for fun. Now, on with our questions. Every year, PWI Magazine ranks the top 50 female wrestlers. I was ranked number eight, and a lot of you have asked me what my thoughts are on it. I'll tell you what I think. I think it's seven spots too low. I think I should be number one. But I also think any female wrestler who works hard at her craft and believes in her abilities should think that she should be number one. ODB was ranked number 32. That's because I'm four times better than her. I'm just kidding. ODB was ranked number 32, and I think you can make a case for her being number one. She is a great wrestler. So an independent worker named Madison Eagles was ranked number one, and I tweeted her, if I see you on the street, it's go time. Just kidding. I tweeted her, congratulations. Uh, when I was younger, I used to fire off angry emails at PWI if I wasn't ranked number one. As I matured, I realized the ranking was subjective and it's an honor to be included in the mix. So I think I should be number one. But any girl on the list who doesn't think they should be number one needs to be in a different business. I have a question from YouTube. Before you go into a wrestling match, what steps do you take to ensure your own physical safety and that of your opponent? How do I ensure my own physical safety? I've trained 12 years in this business. I have a rigorous weight training regimen. I stretch and warm up well before each match, and I say a little prayer before I go to the ring. How do I ensure the safety of my opponent? It's simple. I give them the opportunity not to step in the ring with me. I have a question on Twitter. Where is your favorite place to perform? I have been in hundreds of cities on five continents, and that's an easy answer. Madison Square Garden. It's historic, it's a loud building, and the fans are great. My father went to Madison Square Garden when he was a kid. I won my first WWE championship in Madison Square Garden. The Godfather put me through my first table at Madison Square Garden. And hands down, that is my favorite place, my number one place to perform. I have a question from Jeff on Facebook. I am a teacher in the Chicago Public Schools. I see that you live in Chicago now. Will you stop by my class and talk about the importance of education? Jeff, send me the contact information for the school. If it's legitimate, I'll be there next week. Actually, I'm wrestling most of next week. I'll be there the following week. 